our mount escape counter to our knee slide. He gets your foot, uh-oh. I'm gonna whizzer it, knee slide through, hip goes to the ground, take your time. Yep, slide it out. Yep, now step all the way around over his head. Whoop, good. Yep, you can take his back or you rip that arm off. Beautiful. Doing some drill-ins here. Yeah, keep those hips forward, Lexi. Yeah. Well, don't just try to yank it through. Try to get your left hip to the ground. Okay, now, see your right hand there just hanging out? Grab his knee. Just lift. Slide your knee. <laughs> see? It's so dumb. It's, it's such a dumb thing. But you fight the top leg, not the bottom leg, right? I'm not just going to try to rip it out. Okay, that's how Carl hurt his leg in the first place. Sorry if you're having flashbacks, Carl. <laughs> That whizzer, whizzer, Colin. Yep, there you go. Sink that hip through. There it is. Yep, either put him on his back and fight for the underhook, or we step all the way around the head. Woo. Johnny's posting when he, they lock up the underhook. There you go, even better. With, keep your underhook, stomp your foot out. Good. Ben hits his hip escape, locks up the foot. Billy moves with it, knee slide out. Whizzer, whizzer, whizzer. No. Uh, Billy, reach back with your left hand, grab his knee, lift. Yep, yeah, just right there. As long as you got that wizard and you're keeping your hips forward, it's a pretty good, pretty good position. Even if you don't have the gi to grab onto. Stupid little tricks. Sliding through. Yeah. Yeah. Now, don't don't post your knee. I want this knee sliding out towards me. Oh, it does? Slide. No. I want actually on the side of your knee. Okay. Yes, there you go. So your hip is trying to get to the ground. That's yep, slide your no, don't not backwards, you see? Yep, and that's what we were talking about with keeping your body all on the same side. So you're actually cutting that knee towards me, trying to touch me with your knee and get your hip to the ground. That knee. There you go. Yep, get that hip to the ground. Just out. All right, wherever it needs to be to keep from falling over. But don't push this way too much. No, nope. yep, you want to keep all your weight on this side. The more you can stretch them out, the better. There you go. Yep, and you're trying to pull that foot free. Yep, keep pulling that knee towards his face. All right, and just like I was talking to those guys, I'll keep your weight back. There you go. Now, if you're still not working, take your right hand and grab his knee. Yep, and lift. Yep, now pull your foot free. It's such a little sneaky trick. Right? But as long as you've got a good position... Why do you want that for free? Like, what's that? I feel like I'm just... I'm just why, why do you want to get... Yeah. yeah. Because otherwise your leg is stuck behind you. You can't attack from there. Mm -hmm. it makes it miserable for him to stay right in that position? Potentially. Okay. Potentially. Okay. But I don't get paid for overtime. Fair enough. Right? The faster I can submit her or him, the faster I can go home and get got it. whatever treat I'm looking for. <laughs> It ain't going. It ain't going nowhere. Olivia works very well on negative reinforcement. Oh, ah, getting cocky. Ah, now, remember, remember that hip to the ground. Get your weight out here more. Okay. All right, now slide that knee out with you. Yep, and put your weight on him. Yeah. Hey, keep this leg up, though. Yep. There you go, because you're trying to pull this foot forward. All right, don't worry so much about his knee as you are pulling that knee towards his face. There you go. And then you spin around the head. Stay, keep your weight on him. 